Here's a rundown of your mission. This one's perfect for a warm-up. Nice and easy. Don't let yourself get lazy, though. Stick to it and get the job done. There's a lot of banana cultivation al The supply staging point is at the eastern foot of Irasu. There's a rail terminal there. They'll probably transfer the nuke from the train onto a truck. Gotcha. I'll have to catch them while they're moving the cargo. But you might run into El Basilisco. Keep your eyes peeled, Snake. An 80-foot tall walking behemoth. The CIA's new weapon? Mm. Could be. Too bad it's not actually a dinosaur. I think they're testing it up at the base on top of the mountain. I met a guy in Russia who described it as... A Metal Gear linking infantry and artillery. Metal Gear? Hmm. I've got a bad feeling about this. Like maybe it's connected to everything that's happening here somehow. The nukes? You don't think... What else could it be? If it is up there, I'll just have to improvise. Either way, I won't know until I get there. Watch your back, Snake. Snake, legend has it, a place called Isla del Monstruo is near Costa Rica. Isla del Monstruo? It was discovered in the 18th century by Caribbean pirates sailing over to the Pacific. And the island in Treasure Island is based on one near Costa Rica, too. Ah, uh, Treasure Island. I remember reading that. You've read it, too? Ah, oh, that makes things easier. In Nicaragua, we too have a story about a group of pirates that encountered a flying monster out at sea. Some even say they landed on this monster island, though we still don't know exactly where it is. That's the reason I've always wanted to come to Costa Rica. Ha! <laughs> I see. Ooh, ooh, I heard another story about a talking cat that lives somewhere in Costa Rica. They say it'll take you to this place. Oh, mm, interesting stuff. Want to know more about the island? Maybe later. If I'm headed that way, you can fill me in. Okay, just let me know. Amanda's so bossy. It's always follow me or, or stay here. The other day she told me, chew your Cayo Pinto before you swallow. <laughs> can you believe it? Knowing your sister? Yeah, I can. The enemy could strike at any time. I can't sit around taking my sweet time eating. I'm a Sandinista, just like the others. I don't need some woman telling me what to do. Some woman? She's your sister, and she's doing the best she can to fill your father's shoes. No, I know, but lately she hasn't been doing so good. I should be strong for her. Now you're talking. Sorry to hear about your dad. Don't be. He was... He is a guerrilla warrior. We pledge our lives to our country and its people. I'm ready to die too if I have to. You sure? You better believe it. Like mi viejo used to say. Patria o muerte. <laughs> che said it first. My dad used to tell us all kinds of stories. About General Sandino and his fight against La Guardia. About my mom before she left us. You didn't want to go with her? It's not like that. La Revolución comes first, that's all. You must wish you could see her, though. I don't know. But I know I'll see her again when this is all over. Somehow, I, I just know it. When I do, me and my mom and papa are all going to live together again. At least... At least that's what I thought. Now, I... Hang in there, Chico. Your sister needs you. <sighs> okay. Have you ever heard, shoot, coward? 
You're only going to kill a man. Hmm. Che's last words. He'd been captured in Bolivia and said it to the soldiers just as they were about to execute him. El Che. He was something, wasn't he? Coming up with a line like that knowing he was about to die. After the Cuban Revolution, Che gave up his position in the new government to aid in revolutions in other countries. He knew he could die at any time. And he was ready for it. Me? I couldn't even take a little torture. But you've been reborn as an hombre nuevo. Right, Chico? Right. Don't you ever get lonely living away from your mom? Not really. My compas are my family now. A lot of them are from the same village as me. So you had plenty of people to take care of you. Take care of me? I'm a warrior, like any other Sandinista. We look out for each other. That is how it works. Uh, sorry. Guess I misspoke. Now we're scattered because of that colibri. Wonder where everybody went. Hey, Snake. If you see any friendly prisoners, please, you gotta get them out, okay? Those guys are solid, every one. You could use them in MSF. Hey, Snake. Are there any jobs for me here at Mother Base? I can do anything. You don't have to work, you know. Ah, don't treat me like a kid. I'm a man now. Okay, then. What are you good at? Hmm, let me think. Ah, uh, everything! Pull me on any team. I can pull my own weight. <laughs> well, you are young. You'll probably be a fast learner. I'll think of something. Anything you need, boss. You'll see. I can fight as good as anybody. Fulton recovery subject confirmed on board helicopter. Fulton recovery to helicopter is complete. Recovery subject confirmed on board helicopter.
Head for the recovery zone. We'll pick you up there. 